r slash am I wrong? Throwawayfat2024 says. A w- my wife wants me to stop going to the gym because a cowalker hit on me. My wife 35 female does not feel comfortable with me 40 male working out and going to the gym anymore and is suggesting I quit. I have always been slightly overweight in my 20s and 30s and really let go during the pandemic and gained a lot of weight. It started bothering me and hence last January I joined a local gym and hired a personal trainer. I lost most of the excess weight and the trainer also helped me gain muscle. I love going to the gym now and working out 3, 4 times a week. My wife of course loved my dedication and I sometimes found her staring at me when I was changing, which was cute. Overall, my confidence improved and I also started dressing nicely and everything just fit right. I had a situation happen to me in the summer at my workplace. My wife's friend B also works in my company. One of the girls in my company J, late 20s F, from a different department, started becoming very friendly with me, started joining me for lunches, and slacking me through the day about random topics. I would be busy, and try to be polite and ignore her. However, things got weird, when she got hold of my phone number, which only my manager knows in office, and started messaging me after hours. I immediately drew a line and told her it's not acceptable and only talk to me via company messenger as I do not talk to work colleagues on my personal phone. I also started ignoring her after that except for a polite hello when we came face to face. My wife asked me to report her 2 hours but I did not cause she never messaged me about anything inappropriate. My wife checked with her friend B, and she told my wife that Jay and her friends were discussing my weight loss and how I have completely changed the way I dress. Again, I ignored it as I'm not sure this was raised enough to be reported to ours. The day before yesterday, during our Christmas party, Jay approached me twice and asked me to join her on the dance floor. I declined Dan. Just went about my way. By the end of the night, she came to me, started dancing suggestively in front of me, and did something highly inappropriate. I was shocked, and fell back spilling my drink on myself. Jay's manager swooped in, and told me she had too much to drink, and I never saw Jay again at the party. When I reached home, my wife had already heard about the incident from B. She was crying, and was angry at me. She blamed me for not reporting Jay to hours, when she had told me to. She also said I was drunk, which I was not, and had only 3 drinks during a 3 hour party, and stank like whiskey. After I calmed her down, she asked me to shower and rest. She apologized before sleeping, but told me she felt very violated by Jay's actions and I promised her I would meet with my manager and ours, as soon as the office opens again, which is after New Year's. In the morning, I woke up, and started getting ready to go to the gym. My wife asked me, if I could not go to the gym. I said okay, and we both cooked a nice breakfast, and had fun family time with our toddler. Afterward, my wife asked me if I could hold off going to the gym for a while. She told me that she feels insecure when other women look at me, and yesterday was a deal breaker. We never had any similar issues in the 11 years of our marriage. She loved me just the way I was, and did not care if I became muscular. She told me that the purpose of the gym was to lose weight and I have already achieved it, so I can just maintain where I'm at, and not work out further. Upon further probing, she told me that my losing weight had been a hot topic among her friends group, and she had a fallout with one of her friends, because she made some sexual comments about me. All of this is making her very anxious. On one hand, I love working out now, for the first time in my life. It makes me feel confident. On the other hand, I want my wife to be happy, and this is a very small price, to pay my books. I know she is being insecure and controlling, but I love her, and the life we have built together, and all I want to do, is see her being comfortable and happy. 
I'm holding off going to the gym till New Year's and enjoy the holidays with my family. However, am I wrong to want to continue after that? How do I convince my wife to not be insecure? I know there is no switch, and what are people in this situation done? P.S. I posted this last night, but deleted it as there was. TGF Oblivious says. It sounds like one. You want to go to the gym to maintain your health. 1. She is asking you to make yourself unattractive to other people, so that she'll be the only one who's attracted to you. You are not wrong in wanting to maintain your health. It might make sense for the two of you to attend couples counseling. Kung Funglish says. Honest question, why do they need couples counseling? This seems firmly in the realm of her insecurity, and she needs to own it, and good to individual counseling. Doesn't seem like he's doing anything unhealthy here. He's not entertaining their advances. He's drawing boundaries. He's enforcing said boundaries. It's her that has the issue. TGF Oblivious says. Couples counseling, because of course she's the one who needs individual counseling, but he can't be the one to point that out to her. The whole point is that a couple's counselor can be the one to point out to her that she needs individual counselling and then someone who's not in can point out that she's the one with issues. But in saying something like I'm not doing anything wrong. You have a problem with insecurity and you need to talk to a counselor to help you deal with this is not going to be an effective way to get her to do that. Him suggesting couples counseling and having the reasonable expectation that the couples counselor will point that out to his wife makes him look like the good guy instead of giving her more to worry about. She's currently in a mindset of not feeling that she can trust him, so she's more likely to be suspicious of his actions. Lavaska says. NTA the problem is that other person's behavior not you're going to the gym. Someone else could love your chub too, Wiffy needs to buck up. Iwam says. Right, this is crazy. She is making Op quit the gym, because some chick he works with was flirting and acting inappropriate with Opus. How is that Op's fault? Op's wife is victim shaming him and it's wild. She cried because a cowwalker tried to dance on him, and he wanted no part of it. Also, sounds like B isn't much of a friend. Sounds like she is just trying to stir shit up between Op and his wife. Subreddit censorship says. On average more people are going to be attracted to fit people. His wife is worried that he'll leave her if he's got more options and wants to keep him down. Men do a similar tactic to women all the time. It's a bad look. Gravadigger30 says. You both should go to counseling as was recommended above by the previous commenter. I also think that you're not wrong for still wanting to go to the gym. You should not be punished for someone clearly not respecting your boundaries and attempting to sexually harass you. You should thank your boss for protecting you from a predator and should also discuss having you and that cow can move to different wings or departments of your workplace. SCT62382 says. He's not the one in need of therapy here. Manboy56888 says. Totally. The other issue is that, if he tries to make her happy by giving up things he likes he'll end up losing things he likes and have an insecure miserable wife. Op you cannot make your wife happy when they get into this state of insecurity, there will be more demands and more loss for you. Get her into therapy or plan the exit. Tundi1 says. B is clearly not a good friend to your wife. Unless your wife is very ugly, and even if she was, there are probably men talking about her looks. The difference is you don't hear about it. But there's B, always hearing and telling your wife the details. Is B short for busybody? Second, tell your wife how being physically active makes you feel. Sure you've reached your goal weight, but you don't want to put it all back and have to lose it again. Plus, working out gives you other benefits confidence health and mental health she told me that my losing weight had been a hot topic among her friends group 
and she had a fallout with one of her friends because she made some sexual comments about me. All of this is making her very anxious. Sounds like your wife needs better friends all around. One of them is telling tales and another is openly fantasizing about her husband. All of this isn't your doing. The day before yesterday, during our Christmas party, when I reached home, my wife had already heard about the incident from B. If you're not going to talk to ours about J, skip the Christmas party, or go with your wife. And maybe take her to the gym too. Both of you can get active, and share a laugh at all the people ogling you both. Throw away fat 2024 says. I'm sure she would love to go to the gym. The thing is both our careers are very demanding, and she says she would rather spend her free time with our kid. I also have to wake up really early to go to the gym, so that I can spend whatever free time I have in the evening with them. I also wish I was the first one to tell my wife after the incident and not be. I don't know if she embellished any facts while telling her what happened. I didn't know about her friend's comments and issues until yesterday when she told me. It is really weird and my guy friends do not talk inappropriately about our wives. Not sure this is something that is common among female friends. That's all for this video thank you for watching please subscribe.